Yeah, so here I have uh, Pastor Jaron, and he came to us uh, several weeks ago. He developed uh, some drop foot, which is the L4, L5 nerve. Usually it's from a damaged L4, 5 nerve root in the spine. Um, usually accident or falls or failed surgeries, what happens is the deep perineal nerve, which controls dorsiflexion. It, yeah limits the ability to activate the tibialis anterior and you're not going to get normal gait, uh, the heel strike. Um, so I ordered a, a six, a laser and magnet treatments to help you know, wake up the nerve function and we're going to do a reevaluation, okay? And Jaron, if you don't mind chiming in from the start, sure. Yeah. how you're, what changes have you noticed? Yeah. Um, definitely stronger. Okay. Um, Definitely more range of motion. When you say strength, would you say um, you could push off the ground better with your toe? Uh, I would say that, but more so even like crouching down and being able to get up with more thrust and power. Okay, and good. I, um, I used to when I would bend down, um, this leg would always kind of turn in. Okay, it would buckle in like you yeah. want to film that? Yeah. Can you show the camera it would buckle in like that? Yeah. So show us before. Before, I, you know, kind of be It like would this, buckle in like that, yeah. So I could do it for a long time, but just being able to sit here for a long time like now that. you can squat and hold it in yeah. alignment of your knees. And then just kind of come straight up. You know, okay. So. Now you can probably start doing some air squat exercises yeah. and strengthen everything. Yeah, so, and I would have periods of success before, but then with bending over like this, it would automatically kind of buckle in like that. Okay. So I noticed that that wasn't happening. Like right. when I was going in my drawers, I was just like, oh my gosh. I, yeah, yeah, that yeah. That was cool. And then um, uh, they had me doing the massage on the on the right big toe underneath mm -hmm. there with the golf ball. Okay. And uh, that really helped a lot. Let me see your, I'm going to compare the range of motion. Uh, you take the show? Yeah, go ahead and then try to get it so you can see both feet at the same time. Okay, put the feet even, okay? And I want you to lift your right foot as high as you can, okay, and down. And your left foot, okay, down. You can notice the increase in the range there. Oh, definitely. Yeah, because I know before you can, it was hard to even lift that right foot. Yeah, I was saying. It was like, kind of mimic what it was before, the right so I, foot. I know, it's about even. Yeah. But before it was about how much? Just lift the about, right, I would say about like that. half down. Now he's all the way up. Yeah. So that's definitely fifty percent improvement in the range of motion. You get pretty much full dorsiflexion. Mm -hmm. Now let's see the strength. This is the good foot all the way up. So that's full resistance, and this one, that's pretty good. Because before, yeah. yeah, it wasn't hardly strength. I mean, it almost felt like the same as this one. And let me see your gait. So let's film his ability. Let's see if he has better dorsiflexion. Let's go out here. Uh-huh. The toe pain is kind of throwing it off. And go ahead and come on back. So you could definitely lift that, you get the heel strike back when that wasn't that before. Yeah, I can right? roll on it. It's uh -huh. just um, the main thing is the uh, the toe part. I just got to get that, uh, I just got the MRI back on that one, so. Like the turf toe, yeah. Um, yeah, that's right in here. They're saying I've got a little bit of cystic. Yeah, um, yeah so you're limping because of arthritis. the toe problem arthritis, not because of the weakness. Yeah, not yeah. the weakness yeah. there. And then I still have a little bit of a thing in the back. Okay, all right. But I'm definitely... Uh, yeah. All right. So overall, if you had to put a percentage of the improvement in function, pain, range of motion, if you had to I put a percentage, altogether between ten or fifteen percent. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Consider.